Hello, my name is Arush. I'm from Troop 466. And right now in my troop, I'm doing the pioneering merit badge. For the merit badge, you have to create a structure. And this is my rough plan of what my structure is going to be like. This is what we think it's going to be. The main, we're going to have the height, 12.5 inches. We're going to have four of them. The width, 8.5 inches. And we're going to have 10 of those. And the diagonal, we're going to have 15, which is four. Um, we chose these numbers because if you add 12.5, 8.5, and 15, you're going to get 36, which is the length of the sticks we are going to buy. We got diagonal equals 15 due to the Pythagorean theorem, and so diagonal equals 15. For the platform, we're going to say the width of these is going to be 8.5 for these two, and we're going to need two of them. And then for the length, we're going to have about 22 of them, which is what we're going to be planning on buying. The lashings we are covering in this is the square lashing, the diagonal lashing, and the double floor lashing. The square lashing for this, the diagonal lashing for this stuff, and the double floor for all of these. Thank you, and we hope you enjoy my video. Okay, so for my project, I'm going to need a couple of sticks. So here we're seeing that blue ones are only 69 cents and they're um, 36 inches long. Let's check one of these. This is good, not bendy, sturdy. And as my measurements are 10, 12, and 14, that is going to be about, so these are each 36 inches, about maybe 10 of these. But just to be safe, I'm going to take 12. Okay, so that's not from grace. There we go. Now, I also need to lash my project together, so I'm gonna need some kind of string. Here are the strings. And by loops and threads, that is going to work very well. Alright, so, this should work, it's so cheap, so, look on only cost nine dollars with the coupon as well so bonus the next step is to cut is to cut our required lengths this is a ruler and so first we measure 12.5 and as this is the length this is 12 so we add 0.5 to it 12.5 and there's the 12.5 and then as we also need 8.5 we're leaving the 0.5 to put the extra lashing part on. And then next, we put another 8.5 from the exact location. And this is 8.5. 8.5. So here's 8.5. And then the remaining part we're gonna use to be the diagonal. Right, I just cut the pieces into what they are. This is the 8.5 part, there are 10 of them. This is the 12.5, there are also 10 of them. And this is the 15, there are four of them. These are the leftover, which I'll be using for the top platform. So now, first I'm going to take three of these, and set them up, and then grab five of these, and make a rough three inch apart ladder. That is about three inches apart. That's my first plan figure. The second one, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna duplicate this figure, which means another three. And then I'm gonna use the last five. Two, three, four, five. And then for my next figure, I'm gonna take two of these and two of these. And I'm going to put the small ones, the 12.5s here. And then I'm going to use the bigger ones, the 15s, into an X. And then I'm going to duplicate that figure as well. Which I'm going to put up here. This here. And this here. And then we're gonna make 
yikes again and put the little bit more together there we go those are my figures Due to other circumstances, I have revoked my original plan, and now, as you see, I've already done all the square lashings for both of these. Now, I am going to just put the cross like this. I'm gonna make the X cross this way, both wrapped, with the diagonal lashings, which provides for my second requirement in the due to other circumstances I have revoked my original plan and now just decided to make the cross without the poles I'm gonna be frapped to these. This will be tied with the diagonal lashing which will also satisfy my second requirement for the pioneering merit badge. Okay, so now we have our four sets. These two are diagonal lashing, and all of these are square lashings. So now we are going to put together a structure like this. We're gonna use the diagonal lashings to tie these together and yeah that's about it and then we're also going to use this one which is the exact duplicate on the other side okay so currently we've got a sturdy tower so we're going to put two eight and a half inches over here and then put a bunch of five and a half inches over here to, fit, to build a walkway we are going to build the top platform separately and then add it on top to finish the project. Okay, here I have two eight and a half inch sticks and I have two six and a half inch as well, six inches as well. So I am going to put them on top of here as the top floor. But before that, I'm going to, well here I have about 28 six inches and I am going to tie them all together on top using the, double floor lashing as like that and then so it's gonna go as the top layer on top of this now that we finished lashing these together we're just gonna put this on top of here do the final lashings and then we are done with our project in this part we use 22 sticks 16 sticks Using the uh, right, we've used the diagonal lashing to tie these four corners together to this. So now this is my final project. It's a scout tower, pun included. This this is what's left of our stick materials. We bought twelve blue colored sticks from Michaels, and we only have this much left. So I'd say we did some pretty good calculating. We also bought some pink yarn worth $2 at Michael's as well, and that turned out to be very, very well for tying lashings. Hope you like my project, and thank you.